my name is Sharon McManus and I am an Army Engineer Officer in the Irish Defence Forces. In the Army, in the Defence Forces, the, the Army Engineer role has two distinct um, aspects to it. There's the, um, the, the combat role, which um, involves mobility, counter-mobility and survivability. And then there's, the, I suppose, the civilian engineering type role, which is the maintenance of all our lands. I would say it was my mother who encouraged me to, um, to join the Army. I think she saw something in me when I was quite young, maybe around 12 or 13, and she, she uh, you know, mentioned that the, the Army was a, a career path that I could, I could aspire to, um, which is probably unusual for, for girls and their mothers you know, back then, but um, yeah, she was a, a great influence on me in that regard. Well, I was always very interested in, um, in math subjects and science subjects in school, so I always knew I wanted to do something with maths or science or engineering, but I wasn't quite sure. And, and I was also very active in school, I was, I was quite sporty, I did lots of different sports and um, so I suppose what drew me to the army was the, 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 the want to do something uh, that included travel and included being active and um, an adventure I suppose, that's really what I wanted. I suppose the one thing about engineering that I would say is that it teaches you how to learn, it teaches you a kind of a principle of the, the principles, the, the basic principles of engineering and if you have that curiosity in you and that willingness to, to learn new things, um, you, you'll be learning for, for your whole life and enjoying it along the way. I think um, the advice that I would give is to, to not to doubt yourself, to, to believe in your own abilities and your own skills. Um, especially in, in engineering, nobody has all the answers. It's very much uh, about teamwork. Um, everybody has different skill sets. And we really need, you know, cognitive diversity to, to solve the complex problems that we face in, in societal problems, technical problems that we, that we face in the world today. So I would say, you know, believe in yourself, have confidence, come to the table with your ideas and your opinions and contribute and be part of a team and, and don't feel that, you know, it's all on you or that you have to have all the answers to everything because you absolutely don't. Um, but what you do have is a different perspective, which um, is really needed around the table.